again, this is the simplest quarter circuit, a common source amplifier. Then we flip it to get the counter power circuit to compose the left, the left half circuit. But again, we have only, usually we have only one input to the left and the other input to the right. So for the counter power circuit, the input should be fixed. Okay, that is the usual case. Then we can go further. Yeah, flip this half to the right. We get another half, right? We apply positive input here, negative input there, and then for the counterpart to the top, the bias uh, should be fixed. Okay, and we apply usually bias current in the middle. Then you will see, you will see this is the origination, that is the birth of differential amplifier. Okay? In the past, the teachers only show, hey, this is the differential amplifier. Then derive it. No, 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 right now. We show you how it be invented. Right? How people in the past think about such kind of very innovative structure till now and even into the future i think we will use differential amplifier again and again but how on earth it is created it is invented okay here that's it with the simplest quarter circuit we will make such kind of differential amplifier not only for differential amplifier for all those opamps you learned or you didn't learn Almost every OPAMP can be created in this way. So we call it systematic way for OPAMP creation. Okay? And again, yeah, all, for all those, you can derive it or you can think it by yourself. I, I don't have time. Okay? But the other issue is we need the so called common mode feedback. Yeah, because According to some kind of uh, process variation, yeah, uh, usually for the input, okay, for your own application, we hope the output voltage here or there, uh, if there is no difference, right? No difference for the input. Oh, we have VICM, also we have VOCM. For the output, if no AC input, we hope both outputs, negative or positive, they had better stay in the middle of your supply voltage. Yeah. Uh, yeah, ideally, that is the top and that is the middle, right? We hope both outputs stay here. That is what we hope. Why? Because after you apply sign, some kind of AC signal to your input, after amplification, a very small input signal will be amplified to the output. Okay? That is for your own design, but according to process variation, sorry for that. Ah, 50% will be there, 50% will be here. Uh uh, what it will go wrong? If it is not in the middle, <laughs> right? For example, it is there. It means what? The output stream will become such limited. If you go further, uh, uh, your, the head will be cut. Okay? If it is here, the bottom will be cut. Only if you put, you design your output common mode voltage to the middle of your supply voltages, then you can get the maximum output stream, right? Today, you see this terminology again and again, right? But forget about it. Even you design, for your design, the output common mode, common mode voltage is in the middle after fabrication. <laughs> it will be shifted up or shifted down. Sorry. Wait.
对啊，居住三零零二啊，没有错啊。我跟你讲，今天中午是二点二十分啊。没关系，你拿我的卡片去你记账，去借那个卡，去借泡茶的东西。你拍一下看，好吧？好，拜拜。All right, uh, that is for uh, differential. Uh, uh, so, how to compensate for such kind of process variation happened to your output? We need this one, common mode feedback circuit. Okay, to push back. N ne never mind the final common mode output voltage is here or there to push them back to the middle. That's it. That's it. So later, uh, we need to focus in this chap in this chapter. Yeah, we need to focus how to design a good enough common mode feedback circuit to stabilize your upper voltage. Okay. Anyway, that is for uh, differential one. If you are not interested, you if you only need just like a traditional one, you only need single ended output then. We can <laughs> apply self biasing by diode connection. Okay? The diode connected transistor will help you to stabilize the upper common mode voltage. That's it. Yeah. Anyway. Okay? But in that way, for such kind of diode connection, yeah, you can see. You need to pay for it because uh, there is only one output, not the second, only one. But what is the benefit? First of all, you don't need this one. Okay. Secondly, you can see uh, for your AC input, for example, yeah, you apply more a positive voltage here, less voltage there, right? They are differential. Okay, so you can see more positive current means what? More current downward. Less current downward means what? Because the total current is AC plus DC. Okay, DC decided by this one. Okay, so how to reduce the overall current for Q2? It means what? The AC current flows up. Okay, the, but but the DC for all the DC they flows down, right? So by increase the voltage here, decrease the voltage there, we will flow more current. So the AC current will be downward for Q1, upward for Q2, and you can see Q3 and Q4 through such kind of diode connection, they are current mirror, uh, usually one to one, right? So the AC current will be duplicate to Q4. Ah, ah. So Q4 has downward AC current, but don't get any kind of misunderstanding. Some of the students, some of the students will think, ah, look, downward, upward, they cancel each other. No, 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 no. According to KCL, those two current will be summed, then delivered to the output. Okay, that's it. So you will get double current for your output. It means what? The gain will be doubled for the single ended output configurations. <laughs> okay, that's it. You will double the voltage gain for the single ended output. That is the power of diode connection. A very easy and good skill to simplify your circuit design. You can get rid of the common mode feedback circuit because from your microelectronics, I don't think you they mention anything about this. But for analog IC design, you need to face it. Unless you only need one output. If you need two output, then take care of this common mode feedback circuit. Okay? Yeah. Anyway, you, you can see what's the difference. No divided by two. That's it. Okay? Yeah. For all the others, they are the same. Uh, okay, that's too late because ah, I need to go to the, the other important meeting. So this is the end of today. I hope, as I mentioned last week, I hope I can finish open design.
like this for next week. Okay, one extra week. I need to finish it. Right now, I only teach <laughs> 89 pages. I have totally 300. I need to skip a lot of them. Sorry for that. Thank you. <laughs>